Hey there guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you a quick video of me helping my sister build a frame for a painting that she had painted for one of her friends. Now she's a really great artist, but she's an even better sister, uh, so I was totally happy to help out and I told her to come by whenever she had a chance and we would get something figured out. Uh, so anyway, before the process started, she kept telling me that she thought it would make a great YouTube video and that I should film the process. And to be quite honest, I wasn't really enthused about doing so, but I told her, yeah, you know, I'll film some clips and if it looks like it's going to be interesting, I'll make a video out of it. And if it doesn't, then I'll just delete the clips. Uh, I think you'll see towards the end of the video, it turned out to be something pretty special to me. And uh, I hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed uh, <laughs> seeing the finished result. So one of the things my sister had wanted for this frame is to have pallet wood cladding the back side of it in a shadow box fashion. So what we're doing here is cutting out a recessed part that's going to be on the back side of the shadow box frame. And here she's cutting to length the tops and the sides of the frame and then just using one side and one top uh, to mark the links for the other side and other top. And after we had our links cut, we mitered the corners and got ready to join them up. Once she was happy with the way the frame was looking, we went ahead and added some glue and then joined up the edges with some finish nails. And while the frame was clamped and drying, we went ahead and ripped down some pallet wood boards to make the back portion of the frame that would eventually hold the painting. And once my sister finished cutting the pallet wood pieces to length, she then assorted them on the back side of the frame in a pattern that she liked. And here's where things started to get just a bit funny. When my sister was painting the frame, she asked my daughter to join in. And my daughter just barely turned three, so I kept asking my sister, are you sure you want a barely three-year-old painting a frame that you're going to be giving to your friend? She kept assuring me that her friend would be very happy with it. I put it on both of my brushes. That's it. I do it too. I'm gonna just so you know, I'm gonna mix some of this blue up here, okay? With the after the frame was painted, she put on all the palette pieces, and after I noticed that she wasn't going to correct any of my daughter's painting uh, techniques on the frame, I started wondering who the painting was really for. But at this point, I hadn't seen actually what the painting was of, uh, so I started wondering. So I told her to go grab the painting and we would get a little clip of it actually being set in the frame and this is what she set down. It was a painting of a picture she had taken of me holding my daughter at a little pumpkin festival we had gone to several months earlier. And uh, <laughs> to be honest, my allergies kicked up just a bit. 